Hello world, I'm Agitated Crane, we are back in Darksiders and without further ado, let's just continue! <laughs> Enemies have a chance of releasing a health launcher upon death, which will replenish a charge of our Estus mask. Uh, not mask, flask. And we are back with Ultain in his haven. And we should go to this elevator. So I already mentioned how much I already love this game. Um, Darksiders started copying uh, other games, like um, Darksiders 1 was um, very similar. It's, no, it, it wasn't similar at all, but uh, it took um, inspiration from stuff like uh, God of War and uh, Legend of Zelda. Uh, in uh, the use of like items to I guess progress in the dungeon. And uh, the second one, I'm not entirely sure what they were thinking or what who they tried to copy. It felt almost like uh, Diablo-ish, right? With uh, the loot system and um, leveling up and skill trees, but... Um, yeah, we cannot fly through this air just yet. But this, uh, like this um, idea to try Dark Souls, that's, that's just great. Ah, uh, come on. Oh! I did not notice this person. Do you see that guy? I'm not a fan of that guy. Like, I don't think I can actually defeat him with just my regular weaponry. I mean, I am strong, and we did update uh, our uh, level a little bit, skills. Let's actually take a look at that, because I was thinking about something, and uh, it actually made sense to me. I guess we cannot check it without uh, going to Ulgrim. I'm thinking that maybe arcane damage uh, scales more, like... Um, Let's say, when you increase strength, you increase it by 5%. I think if you increase arcane damage, you increase it by more. I'm, I'm not entirely sure, but... Uh, I think that that is the case. So... Um, and of course, um, arcane damage is damage dealt on evade counters. Which... Um, is interesting, to be honest. Like... If you are Souls games enthusiast and you know how to counter, I think you would be benefiting a lot from that um, arcane stat. But since I am a dirty casual, I will be going for raw damage. And hopefully... Oh, here is, here is Wulgrim, so we can actually check with him. What would you ask? This will be fun for both of us. Okay, we cannot actually <laughs> check with him. <laughs> Never mind, we don't have enough souls. But I think I can kill some people and uh, get enough souls, right? Also... Interesting. Interesting. That was me just holding the mouse button. I don't want to... Eh, maybe like this? Oh, nope. See, that was counter. I did not expect there to be counter, but I'm happy that there was. Nice. Okay, <laughs> that was uh, <laughs> very lucky. Nope. Ow. Nope. Okay, how about this? Whew. 
the cover. And everyone is killed. Great. Now let me just make sure that there is no surprises incoming. And let's start looting stuff. Rat shard, and we can actually jump downstairs. Interesting. I don't want to do it just yet because I I don't think we can uh, go back if we try. There is enemy, right? No, no enemy. Okay. More soul clumps. Now, clumps, um, or I guess shards. I think I will be calling it shards. It's, uh, it's going to be easier. Wow, that's something new. Wow, okay. But I actually cannot... No, he does get staggered. Okay, he's dead. And he dropped Sliver of Adamantine. I think we now have enough to actually upgrade our whip. So yeah, that's, uh, these uh, soul shards. Uh, I'm keeping them because I have this feeling that it's going to be even more like Souls games. In, in the sense that uh, we are gonna need them for upgrades or something like that. I think. But honestly, so far, it doesn't look like we will be needing them, so maybe I can just spend them on Vulgrim. Not yet, though. I want to check with him. Do I do I want to feed him souls. Will be fun for both of us. Uh, come on. Nice. Level up. As you wish. And so, um, this is what I was talking about, right? Yeah. See, physical damage scales by 5% um, and arcane damage by 7%. So if you are good at dodging uh, and like evasions and stuff like that, you can actually go arcane route. And so, so you, you wouldn't be playing berserky mode like I do, but you would be like waiting, baiting them to attack you, evade them, and then do more damage, right? That is, um, I think, a reasonable strategy. Now, I'm never that good with uh, spells uh, in um, Darksiders. Like, uh, I haven't used a single spell in Darksiders 1, and I have tried to use some in Darksiders 2 because it's easier to use, but um, I'm not big on it. But uh, here we, we can see that uh, it's it's not only from for evasion, but also charge attacks, which I think we haven't unlocked yet. Wrat attacks, which uh, one of them is definitely that uh, area of effect um, that I did uh, a few minutes ago when I was uh, fighting a, a large group of enemies and Havoc form attacks. Now I feel like Havoc form uh, deals insane amount of damage as it is and I think uh, we will be using it mostly to gain like damage immunity, right? Instead of um, doing massive damage. So I think it did this. I, I don't think we will be spending too much on arcane health. I think we are fine for now. Although it is definitely a possibility. So I will be spending a lot of points on strength because that's just the way I play. But yeah. If you are more into counters, if you know how to counter properly, you can probably... Like, I, I think Arcane could be a viable strategy if you are good with... good in soul games. And we got an achievement. Spend, spend an attribute point, but... I mean, we have did before. Okay. 
So I do want to go check that guy out, but I don't have that much like confidence in myself just yet. I don't think I will be able to dodge his attacks and he will just one shot me. So I will be trying to explore first. I did already look everywhere there. I'm interested in that area upstairs. Now how would I go there? Who knows? Huh. Also I probably should just go to Ultane and um, level up some of, some of my stuff. I think we can increase um, whip damage already. Yeah, this is not happening. So let's try to to jump into this tunnel. Oh, all right. Please, no, just, 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 just kill me. Now I... stop your blubbering, human. Come to me. Now. Do you want to live? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? If you want to live, I can send you to a safe place. Come with Seven. me if you want to live. <laughs> Touch it. Come on, human. Idiots. It's a miracle they ruled the earth for as long as they did. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so that was... So will we always get a cutscene or uh, is this going to be different each time? Huh. And I wonder if uh, Ultain will give us some rewards of, or if it's just another NPC to interact with uh, a la Soul Games, right? Um, another thing I forgot to mention when it came up and uh, since I've been thinking about the game a lot, I just realized something. Uh, Fury going after Sins. Oh, it smells like death in here. Trust me, we shared a room a thousand years ago. Wow, <laughs> okay. <laughs> so it's uh, it's interesting that she's going after sins. Oh my god, I, I think I see mosquitoes. Because um, the way I see her right now, I feel like she... She is going to be susceptible to other sins. Like definitely Envy because uh, we have her in Pokeball right under our belt, right? And so I think uh, we will be slowly going mad. Like we are envious of that because that leads... Uh, Mm, the horseman right now. We are also prideful and the watcher that we received is very psychophantic so I, I think uh, our pride is going to rise even more. Obviously we are angry so we are wrathful as well. Oh my god, we are probably greedy because we are we are going to hoard some souls. Ow. Okay. Not a fan of this, not at all. Wow, okay, no. Uh, we should rethink our... ...tactics. Alright. Nope. Ah! All right, that is better. Uh huh. Now let's. I actually want to go back up because I see those mosquitoes and I don't want to deal with them just yet. Well, no, that's not actually true. I want to deal with them before 
they overwhelm me. Now how would I go about dealing with them? Oh! Wow, okay. Nope. Nice. Whew. Okay. I'm hating on these uh, little bastards. Okay. Haha. <laughs> but shit. Now, see this, mm, that. Um, now that I discovered this whirlwind um, attack, I guess. And that is um, for holding the mouse button. I feel more, more con confident because, um, like, regular swings are more direct on one enemy, right? Uh, so it likes. Um, it like. Uh, gives them an opening to attack me from the sides but with this like this is just area of, of effect attack so that that is great also you bastards can i e you i probably cannot let's not even attempt it okay at the very least they are dying that is great Do we see anything in here? Nothing. Okay. Okay, we can deal with this. So I wonder whether I'm going into direction of, of like a boss battle or if I'm just exploring the area. Like, I, I wonder how direct the, um, the game is going to be, right? Because uh, Dark Souls is not very direct game. It's it's very open world, worldly. Oh, wow, okay. None of that. Stealthy little bastard. Like, you can... Uh, you can avoid some of the bosses, right? So I'm wondering if uh, that is going to be a case in this game. Obviously we are going to try to, like, kill everyone who we find. But it's still, like, interesting, right? Well, at the very least it's interesting to me. But they are going to fall on me or something. Okay. Those consumables, I wonder if I can sell them. I hope I can. It looked like an item that um, a beam. No? No items there? Okay. This is strange. No items in trash. Oh my god. Look at them. Look at them scurrying around. And I can actually go down there. Should I go down there? There are items. Okay, let's see. Oh, no. How about this? Great. Nope. Well, again, my playstyle is a is a little bit berserky. Like I'm I'm just going to dive in, take damage, heal, and try to do more damage than they do to me. So get used to it. There will be no precisions in in this let's play. What? Thank you. Whew. 
Ah. Okay. Damn it. But I feel like we haven't done anything much. But okay. I should try to follow what I like the rules I, I set up. I think it's um, it's supposed to be healthy for my channel to upload sh shorter videos because like no one watches three hour long videos and uh, they get buried in um, in like YouTube um, searches, right? So um, I'm trying to keep my videos shorter, uh, but I will be probably uploading more because you know, it, it's silly. So yeah, I have been agitated crane. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I will be back very quickly, like immediately. Goodbye.